Christy Fajardo is live in Westwood. And Christy, the counties in our viewing area are taking very different approaches depending on where you live. That is actually very true. Here in LA County, public health officials say our numbers are just too high. That's why if you're over the age of two and you go into businesses like the ones here behind me, you'll still have to wear a mask. But come next week, some of the neighboring counties say the mask can come off. Vaccine cards now a license to go maskless in parts of California. The governor announcing he's letting the indoor mask requirement for those who've gotten a shot expire the day after Valentine's. We wear it on our eyes, but yeah, we'd rather not wear it, of course. The requirements were reintroduced when Omicron was first surging, and mandates will stay in place for high risk settings like public transit and also schools. Kids still must wear one of these in the classroom, and the unvaccinated of all ages will still need to mask up inside businesses. The state is also letting counties set their own stricter rules. And for now, LA County isn't ditching indoor masking, saying COVID transmission is still too high. So, wait, it's not lifted? It's lifted for the state of California, but uh, not for LA County. So how does that makes sense. It means that we're not going to get it. It's not lifted here, so it doesn't even affect me. So just on paper, it's lifted, and then we just have to deal with it. I think it's the safest thing to do. Like, there are definitely people at risk, and I think it's just a way to respect one another. And it's just like, I think by, the t by now, I think most of us are used to it, so I don't see why there's a problem. The county public health director, Dr. Barbara Ferrer, says county coronavirus numbers are dropping, but still recorded more than 4,000 new daily cases. At a briefing last week, she said the county won't be considered out of the surge until COVID hospitalizations drop to 2,500 for seven straight days. This is not the right time to stop wearing our masks when around others indoors and in crowded outdoor settings. But Riverside and Orange County say they will follow the state guidelines and the indoor mask mandates go away next week. And in case you're wondering about San Bernardino and Ventura County, so are we. We actually reached out, but I've yet to hear back. We'll keep you posted. And one more thing you should know, up until now in the state of California, if you were visiting a nursing home or a hospital, you needed to bring proof of a negative COVID test. That's no longer the case. Effective immediately. Live in Westwood, Christy Fajardo, Fox 11 News.